For a couple. A couple of something, yeah. <laughs> I guess you could say that. <laughs> no, no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Whoa. Babe, what's happening? What's going on? It's over between us. It's over between us? Yeah. Oh my God, what are we going to do? I felt suffocated. You felt suffocated by me? Oh, I was just so overbearing, wasn't I? Also. What else is going on? I took the kids. Oh, you took the kids? I don't get the kids anymore? No, Hold on, but, I but get- you had a, a, a very dark secret exposed. Right? Oh my gosh, what was the dark secret? I don't know. Oof. I only have this photo. Must have been really dark. Thanks, Melissa. Thanks. It's not the first week. Whatever. Let me tell you what All happened. Right, well, no, let me no, tell no, you what happened. No, no. Okay, yeah. so I've never kissed yeah. a guy. So okay. I was, I was so. I mean, you know, Ash was attractive, and yeah. I was a fourteen-year-old little girl, and I was extremely scared for my life. Sure. And it, he, he was very nice about it. He was like, "Oh, don't worry." So was, he was twenty, and she was fourteen. Et was there on set, and we couldn't believe Ashton's answer to, "What do you like about Mila?" We have great sex, and it, and it's amazing. I mean, she's good looking too, but. Uh, I mean, the sex and her looks. She's a good-looking kid. He was being a wise guy, but Ashton had everyone laughing as he joked about their on-screen relationship. We have great sex. Other than that, I mean... No, I remember, you know, hair appeared in certain areas that it wasn't there before. Things grew. You know, school, I was in school. I, there's a lot. I mean, my life changed during the show. Like, anything that... And I went on my first date while doing the show. I had my first kiss on the show. You know what I mean? So, a lot of things um, I remember from the and uh, Ashton Kutcher and Mila Kunis. Yep, they're a couple. They're hanging out, enjoying themselves. And we hope you are too. Like, that's love right there, Stu. Hi, my name is Mila Kunis, and I'm from that 70 show. And you're watching uh, In the Crease TV. Hi, I'm Ashton Kutcher, and I'm from that 70 show TV. No, that 70 show oh, too. Yeah. But, and the reason I'm doing this it's not because I think in the crease is good, but because Josh told me me and I would sit on my lap if I did. <laughs> <laughs> it feels good. <laughs> 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 And guys, together right here. And Mila, one more time on the left side, please. Mila told us her reaction when she found out she was picked to play Ashton's girlfriend. I started yelling. It was just the biggest shock. I was so excited. I was, if it wasn't in school, I'd probably start crying. But it was just a really big. Hmm? Why are you doing this? What do you, I like, what do you think is going to happen? Well, I think that Khaleesi and Jon Snow are going to have to put their differences aside and get themselves some Cersei ass. That's right. what I think is going to happen. Okay. And, and what do you think is going to happen with Samuel? Listen, I think Sam's going to be fine. I think Sam's smart. He worked at the Citadel. He saved literature before that shit exploded. He's got a baby to protect. And, and what about uh, Bran? What do you think about the Three-Eyed Raven? Do you think I don't he, fucking get is Bran. Is he the super villain? I don't understand what's happening. Oh, no. You mean like, is he the Ice King that everybody projected him to be? No. Could he be the, he, could he be no. plotting a whole I don't thing? even... I don't understand why he told, turned around and was like, I'll see you later. His eyes rolled back and then he flew away. What did he go off to see that he had? What was that that you said? What? What was that that you said? <laughs> what did you say? I can't do it because I'm laughing. <laughs> Hold on. I can't. I'm sorry. I'm of laughing. Of course you can do it. Don't question my intelligence, Derek. <laughs> Every Wednesday night, Mila and I have a date night. 
uh, and usually we go to dinner or a show, but every once in a while, I'll try to come up with some like magical way to say I love you that I've never done before. And I realized that I spent countless hours like pining over what to do, where to do it, trying to find a venue, trying to find the right people to pull it off, trying to make it really personal. And when it's all done, it's all done and it's wonderful and I've done it. But all of that planning and effort has gone to this one experience. And I thought, what if I could share those ideas with other people and take out all the planning and the venues and the people and the effort and actually just make it a simple bookable experience? So we started a company called Date Night. You can find it at datenight.vip. There's an experience, a date that's available right now in Los Angeles. You can find it on Airbnb Experiences. I hope you have fun. I hope you enjoy it. I All right, ranch fans. It is time that we unite. It is time that we take down uh, the Netflix life top Netflix show, March Madness Bracket. And I need you. Um, I'm here on a ride along with. Uh, oh my God. Lady Kunis. Here, just drive. Just focus on driving. I hate Kunis. you. Just, just focus on driving. I hate you so much. You don't have to hate me. You got your sexy librarian glasses on, and you're eating your burrito, and you're driving at the same time, and we all love you for it. So stupid. <laughs> all right, so check it out. Uh, the Netflix Life Facebook page. You have to heart the ranch right now because we got to take this thing down. It, 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 ladies and gentlemen, the ranch must bring the Gilmore girls to slaughter today. <laughs> um, so if you get a chance, the link below this one on my Facebook page, go to Ash and Kutcher uh, fa at Facebook.com. Go, wait, well, you're here, so obviously you know how to find my page. So go to my Facebook page, the link below this one. You have to go and you have to vote you have to heart. You have to heart it, okay? We're the heart button, not the like button. If you don't know how to heart it, in the comment section, if you slide the, you gotta slide the little thing to the left and push the heart button, because we got we gotta win this thing. There ain't, you know, it's like it's us versus Gilmore Girls for the top show on Netflix, and the people need to know where the ranch and where the ranch fans are at. We need you today, and we need you to tell everyone to watch the ranch on Netflix. Cause we gotta keep this thing going. Yeah. So, oh, oh, Paula, you love the Gilmore Girls. I know you love the Gilmore Girls, and that's fine. You can love us both. I love the Gilmore but Girls. But we need babe. the hearts. You love the Gilmore Girls? I do, I do, I do, but I don't love it as much as the ranch. You like the Snooky St. James? Snooky? Is it Snooky <laughs> or Snooky? <laughs> Snooky's from the. the that's the, that's New Jersey Shore. Jersey Shore, right. So it's Snooky St. James. I only know this because my daughter got a Snooky St. James doll <laughs> the other day. But I'm te but come on, you Colt, Rooster, Unite, just take a moment. I'm gonna be here for a second. Go vote now. Get put the heart. We do the heart. Heart for the ranch. It's the link below this one, below this live video chat. There's the link. You go there, and we are gonna win this March Madness bracket one way or another. It has to happen. <laughs> Best show ever. Love it. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, I love the Gilmore Girls, but I love you, and I love your family more. Thank you, Nikki! Um, who else is out there? People write at the same time. Not only the ranch is great. Yeah, they're all writing, so you can see their comments. Don't read because you're driving. Or put the, car, put the car in autopilot if you're going to do that. At the very least. <laughs> I don't know. All right. That's really cool, though. Um, so uh, the wife and I are going to look at refrigerators right now. we got a big <laughs> shopping day. Uh, we're going to go do some appliance shopping. Um, and but we, I need you to vote for the ranch because this has to happen. We got to take them down. And if you don't know how to use the heart button, ask somebody how to use the heart button. Go vote for the ranch, March Madness Netflix style. We have to win this Netflix life thing. Here in Ashton Kutcher is befuddled by Sookie, Sookie's name. Yeah, gives me hope. I have you can have hope in me, you can believe in me. I met one of the desperate orange orange wives, uh, orange no house the Beverly Hills wives yesterday, and uh, I didn't know who they were, and my and Mila got upset because apparently she taught her daughter how to walk like a model, to walk like you're hungry, and as a former male model, you are you actually are hungry, so you don't even have to act like you're walking like you're hungry, you just 
hungry. No, she didn't say walk like you're hungry. She says like walk like you're going to the bodega. <laughs> I thought it was like walk I said, like, like you're. Oh, I thought, you're supposed to be I, thought hungry. I thought it was walk like you're hungry and you're going to get food. Isn't that what you said? That's what I said. I was oh. like, oh, that means you're hungry. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know. But that that. I'm it, proud of you for even knowing what the real housewives. I of Beverly baby, are. I did really good. I met one of the real Beverly housewives. <laughs> Job. Yeah. So, and I knew who they were. So, well, uh, all right. Back to the matter at hand. If you're just tuning in, go to the link below this one and vote up the ranch. We're up against the Gilmore Girls. It's the finals. We are. We beat Orange is the New Black. We beat Narcos. We have beat them all. And now it's time. It's the it's the last round. It's championship time. We are the Gonzaga of this tournament. Well, not really, because we're actually like the underdog, so, and I think they were a favorite. But we were the number six seed. They seeded us wrong, because they didn't know we were country strong. And they don't know about country strong. They don't know about my country people out there. So, let's go get it. <laughs> let's be country. Let's make it happen. Hashtag America. Oh, That's yeah. right. What? Oh, what? God. What? You're so nerdy. Oh, thanks. See, this is what I get. See, she's like, tell, tell me I'm nerdy while I'm riding shotgun in people her car. That have nothing. Boy, you keep, stop shopping. Look at all these people. They're hardening and loving and liking you. But I don't understand. What do you think of the wife's glasses? Do you like her librarian glasses? Hold I on. think it makes her look like a sexy librarian. Can I, can I ask, are these people doing this all from work? They're all watching live. There's like 8,000 people watching this live right now. Yeah, they're all at work. They're for sure at work and they got their headphones in so nobody knows that they're actually just watching live videos on Facebook. Wow. Um, wow. Yeah. Hello, Facebook. Hello. Uh, Doreen says to say hello to my beautiful wife. Well, Doreen's got really good taste. Yeah, I, I, I agree. <laughs> Give my silver fox Sam a kiss for me. Well, I'm not kissing Sam because if I try to kiss him, he put me, drop me on my ass. So that will not be happening. Uh, okay, you convinced me. I voted for the ranch. Thank you, Amanda. We appreciate it. All right, guys. Uh, have a good one. Take care. Much love. Uh, don't forget, go to the link below this one. And the posting right before this one, and go and heart the ranch on Netflix Live. We gotta win this thing. I'm gonna check the count, and if y'all don't get it done, I'm gonna be very, very upset. And so will the hot librarian <laughs> wife. That's like 8,000 votes, right? That should be nine. There, there are 9,000 people watching this. That should be 9,000 votes for the ranch. Okay. That's it. All right. Take care. Peace out, guys. Be good. Bye.